You're back again with the one handed gardener. How are you doing this week? We are with the marjoram. Does it look so beautiful? Luscious, luscious, green. Yes, this is forever producing and producing and producing this space is so empty but it will not be empty anymore because I'm going to plant some parsley in the hope they will grow and produce as much as they, this marjoram why I'm doing that is because like in the supermarket we have a bundle that you could always go to the supermarket and, and find marjoram, parsley, choice and a, a, a pepper. Well yes we are growing peppers but that's not I'm not I'm not doing that right now. So I want, <clears throat> what I want to offer is marjoram and parsley. My, my mom is growing some choice at the front of the house. So I, I will just put some parsley, marjoram and choice and give it away. Yes, because you can always go to the supermarket and, and just buy it, you know, so. I don't think I could get into that market. So I'm just giving it away around who is close and whoever asks for it. I will go to sow the parsley right now. If you are hearing the wind, you know Barbados. I'm wind. I love wind. But Barbados had last week a uh, tropical storm a little touch of it and now we have a tropical wave so it just is passing passing or past us already but we are still having strong wind and I love it I'm loving it rain wind love it so I have three types of parsley dark moss curl Italian plain leaf and what the, a lot of the world says coriander but for Barbarians all are all are parsley so this is a type of parsley and I am going to grow this dark moss curl. So we're going to start planting. But before that I'm going to clear this part of this parsley. We have this growing everywhere so there's no need for it to be in here and then I will clean up. To where that rock is I will clean up to there and my chick my my clean this part as well and leave this lush bush here I will leave this one that was tidy up each side we have, a, we have a frame and that will be that earthworm that I put in the pot from the time I started gardening through my window in this planter pot 
each each part has a earthworm and they have to get another earthworm so they don't feel alone just this middle of this mandarin I will have and there's some space at the front too and I might plant some more marjoram and just have one line of marjoram Woo! This wind! Woo -hoo. We're going to plant this this parsley now I have put in the holes the holes <laughs> you know I can't hold it because I have only one hand so the plant is helping me <laughs> so the seeds have been planted so we will see if they germinate and and grow and grow you know that I have planted some parsley before but it did not come. I don't know if it's because it's an old packet but when I grow the turnips that was an old packet as well. So I would just see how this, this ones, these ones grow. I will try to put them in the, the sun whenever it comes out but we did not have sun like that for say a week because it's been raining and I was at, and I have been enjoying and my tomato patch hopefully next week you will see how much plants I really have in that tomato patch and I want to buy a sheet. Yes, a sheet. I want to be a little more independent. Yes. I want to have a little sheet. Some days I, I will let someone help me to go outside and talk to the sheet, give it some water all of this with my one hand I just want to be more active it's very hard here where I live because the ground is uneven so I can't really walk on it properly with even a can but I will still do it if I have to fall down I will just get up yep that is what you have to do in like you fall down and just get up so I want to buy a sheet so I have to save and save for that because like uh, a lamb or even a sheet uh, you I want a woman sheet that's like say uh, 300 or 400 bajan so that would be like 200 US I have to save for that and I will get my sheep. I have a lot of grass around me. As you will see in my some of my videos, you will see I have land and grass is forever around me. So when they're cleaning here, this land, you can put them at the neighbors, anything. Everyone here helps each other. So I know my sheep will never be starving. <laughs> that is what I want to do for the future. I want to do it this year and it's only more four, four or five months left in the year. Yes, I want a sheep before December. I want a woman sheep at you so that later I could get get lands from it and then get some lamb shops and that will bring me needed funds 
for my family, my daughter's school, and for groceries. Yes, I. My husband is doing his part. I cannot. Although yes, half of me is working. My mind is working, so I can think of ways to support my family and help my husband. Pray for me that I will but, uh, um, um, uh, amass the money to, so that I can buy my sheep. So until we meet again next, next week, keep planting!